Alrighty, hello. I'm making this solely so I can, I can rant a little bit and be upset. So, I have figured out um, why these things, these little vines right here, don't have collision. It's not, it's not even collision. It's why you can't press circle to like latch onto them. Why none of these things down here work. And it's this little fucker right here. I can get any view. This thing right here. And this vine that we conveniently can jump to with DSJ. Which is one of the worst things about this game at a top level. Is this this horrendous trick. Now, you might have noticed that when I was looking there, it, it was there. And you might be thinking, man, why why are you getting upset at this this poor little tree branch? Well, let me show you why I'm getting upset at this poor little stupid tree branch. Look. It's not there. The tree branch doesn't spawn in. Let me kill this little dude here. This tree branch right here does not spawn in until you touch the exact vine that we jump to from the rock when we do DSJ. This vine right here, everything along this vine, all you have to do is touch this vine, and the instant that you touch it, that tree branch down there spawns, and then all of the collision down here spawns. So you can circle jump to this, you can circle jump to the vine that goes underneath the river, or underneath the waterfall from over there. You do all of this stuff, but you have to touch this vine first. And it it's so weird and so baffling to me, because the first two hub worlds are designed in such a way that we can skip them. We can skip them. And yet, you know, in World 3 and 4, you can't skip them because they're chain triggers. Exactly like this is. I have to do something in the level previously before I can access stuff later in the level. You see it right here? I'm not. I'm down here, but the vine isn't here. So I go over here. I can't press circle. Even though I'm on this portion of the level, which this is what we thought was the thing the whole time, was that it was, it was like slides height based, and that like maybe your grounded position needed to be set at, you know, Y coordinate, or I think that'd be Z, needed to be set to a specific Z coordinate before it would let you do anything. No, it's just you need to touch this one stupid vine. <laughs> See if I can, there we go. <clears throat> See, notice there's no tree branch. Can't circle jump to that. As soon as I touch this, that tree branch spawns in. And now, works just fine. It just, it makes no sense to me. I don't get why individual levels like this can work, but then you can skip hubs 1 and 2, and then like, hubs 3 and 4 behave exactly like this, where certain conditions have to be met in the world before other things can happen. It's so weird. And what's even more frustrating <laughs> about this stupid vine here is look at how high up, well, if the game will let me move, look at how high up I can be in the air, and how far away I can be from this and still trigger it. Look at how far away that is. You can almost jump from the vine up there at the start of the level. You can almost just make that jump. Stupid cinematic camera angle nonsense. You can almost just make that from up there. Like, you, you can't... <laughs> at least so far I haven't been able to make it, but... Look at how far away I'm triggering this from! That's so stupid! <laughs> Why? Why is this one... Why is this vine, of all the vines in the level, have this stupid of a hitbox, and that's the one where everything else is tied to. Like, you, you wrap up everything else with, you know, this this really pretty Christmas packaging, right? You, you buy a fancy bow and everything like that, and then the, the tag that says, like, to blank, from blank, is just like a fucking piece of notebook paper. 
<laughs> with like a fucking Crayola marker wrote on it, like two Sly Runners from Dread Swamp Path. <laughs> and you open it up, and it's this horrible trick that we have to do. It it's so weird, and I I just I don't get it. It's so it's so weird to me. And I wonder how many things in other levels are like this, where we've been so close to something, and we try to figure it out, and we've just had the wrong idea, and it's it's something like this. And what's even crazier about this is if I don't checkpoint, like, if I don't go over there and trigger this checkpoint and I die, it will still respawn. This is gonna be awful. Actually, there's a, there's a convenient torch right here just to show it off. Just to show off this last little thing and then I'll end my little rant about this level. And the general game design choices of this game. Or actually, another- th so one last thing, one last thing that I wanna- I wanna complain about <laughs> and rant about is, uh, is right here. And, well, okay, that, that's, that's wacky, but that's not what I'm gonna play at. It's this. Okay. <sighs> Give me a second. <laughs> I'm bad at the video game, apparently, and I don't know how to jump properly to things. Here we go. It's right there. You can stand right there, and you would just be able to jump to this vine, and it wouldn't matter. You can also jump to this vine from pretty much anywhere up top there. The problem is... What's really frustrating about this is every way to get up there is just worse than DSJ. <laughs> like it's just, it's just worse than this chick that's already bad. <laughs> but I I honestly I almost feel like we should try to find ways to like hit this vine from up here. But I I've been sitting here trying to do this and I I can't seem to get it. Because it feels like you need to be really high up and really close. It's like the farther away you get from it, the higher up you need to be in order to trigger it, if that makes sense. So like that kind of height is just almost not even like feasible. Wow, I like how I've done that on accident three times. You see, like, that's more like the height you would, you would have jumping down from the vine up top. And I, like, I, I don't I don't think you can be, like... I mean, that's, like, kind of close to something you could, like, feasibly have. I don't know, maybe you could do that. I'm gonna keep sitting here and mess with it for a little while longer, because I hate this trick, and anything that I can do to get rid of it <laughs> is gonna be good. And plus, it, you know, that's a really easy jump. That'd be a, a nice, nice, um, a skill cap lower, I guess. It's not really like a skill cap lower. I mean, it is, but it, it also, like, it, it, it's more accessible, I guess. But anyway, this, this video's gone on for far too fucking long. Um, I'm sorry, I just wanted to rant. <laughs> and ranting sometimes goes on a long time. But, uh, yeah. Peace out, guys.